Women used to be hot. Women were skinny and, and men were men, fat. And, and now look, men are skinny and women are fat. What's the what's the problem? Yeah. Hey everyone, here's an edited clip from a boy boy live stream. If you want to catch these live, they stream three times a week on Twitch. Enjoy this highlight. Alright, let's get into more fun news. Uh apparently the world is uh is fat. is fat. We got the fat we got we're on, we're in fat world now. Yeah. Um you know how there are like parallel universes and you get transported? We're the ones that people get transported to when they go like, oh, what if it was Earth but everyone was fat? That's 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 today. That's that's the, the, we're in that universe. We got transferred already. The yeah. Wally, the Wally, what, Wally? How you say yeah, that? I don't know. I've never name? watched that. Wally, that movie name. Uh, yeah, they're all fat in them. Oh, really? They're all really fat in You haven't seen it? No. They're all on this uh, uh, fucking uh, ship going through space and everyone's really fat. They're all just like too comfortable. Oh, eating, they've, got, eating. they've got robots doing all robots their- do everything. They just sit in lounges and eat food and do all this stuff. Speaking of being fat and eating food, would you like Uber? Yeah. Now? I don't know. I'm kind of hungry, but I did, did just eat like two hours ago. But talking about living on the fat planet, maybe be like I want to make use of the fat that I'm we on can the order fat some, planet. We'll order some bit later. Okay. But tell us about this article. Okay, fine. I haven't actually read it. I just saw the saw that we <laughs> you were just fat. like the headline. <laughs> What's the fattest country? <laughs> Uh, well, well, the horrible thing is it's it's the islands. Yeah, Those yeah. Pacific Islands. American Samoa, number oh. one. Tonga, number two. Nauru, number three. Cook Islands, fucking hell. Cook, I mean, the place is called Cook Islands. Obviously, you're going to be eating a lot of food. <laughs> yeah, it's God. Cook Islands. That's, that's the island Let's the cook these stuff. islands up, huh? <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, it is it is very sad for these yeah Pacific Island nations where they just got completely like ran ran over by colonialism. Well, like, mm. why is that? Is that because of they have to? Yeah, yeah. They, there's, there's so, like, nothing. all the and Nauru doesn't even have any land anymore. Big hole. Yeah. They have to. <laughs> they have to hide the refugees somewhere. Yeah, import everything. Yeah, it's not. They have to import everything. Like, obviously, all their like native production is is wiped out. So they're just eating stuff, and they're eating like processed foods that like only got introduced like a, literally like two generations ago. Like the Saudis are have it are are pretty high up as well, and that's probably they, they also have them. But also, but with them. I don't understand about the Saudis. Are they are they tracking the like Filipino and Indian migrants who are slaves in Saudi Arabia? Because they're probably not getting fat. No. Yeah. Maybe they are. Yeah. Well, they couldn't. They would be working all the time. Yeah, yeah Drew, you don't have time. It's the big big Saudis who don't work. It's like and it's, plan, it's, it's, and it's it's also um, survival bias because it's, it's the thin ones are the only ones that survive. When when the stadium collapses and the and the crane comes, yeah. chances of getting hit is reduced by being emaciated. Yeah. And where else is big? South Africa. That's a nice little oasis of... Uh, <laughs> Western Valley. Uh, Western Valleys that are left yeah. behind. Um, I want I want more information. Wait, 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 what's happening? What are we looking at? Global prevalence of adult malnourishment by sex. More um, women are obese, but more men are underweight. Is that what they're saying? Uh, Man, all those men's right activists were right. What? Women men, are getting women. Women are secretly fat. If you feminism is making them fat. Exactly, they are getting more unattractive. Back in my day, women used to be hot. Women were skinny, and, and men were men, fat. And, and now look, men are skinny, and women are fat. What's the what's the problem? Yeah, BMI. Oh, it's BMI. Is that what it is? Oh yeah. Because yeah, uh, yeah aren't women naturally a bit yeah like more of the like, yeah like we've got more muscle or something like that. That's more of our weight. Oh, wait, so we got more. I don't, I don't understand. understand. Numbers. Also, less men are underweight now than they were before. Yeah, that's good. Progress. Good work, everyone. And less girls. Come on. Boo. Girls, pick up. You need to carry your weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, I think there's a pretty clear implication of this. Me, whenever you see this, cause what are they attributed to anything? Oh, let's see. Is there anything we can read in this article and be like, why is it like this? So many people are struggling with their weight shows that obesity is more than a matter of dietary willpower. True. And? The human body has evolved to survive winters and famines. It is designed to cling on to body weight and will resist efforts to lose it. A superabundance of cheap, ultra-processed foods has also triggered overeating just as lifestyles have become more sedentary. Weight loss drugs are starting to arrive but remain prohibitively expensive for money. <laughs> That's the <laughs> issue. The weight loss more drugs are Ozempic. More drugs. More Ozempic. Send Ozempic out to Nauru. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Send Ozempic out to American Tonga. <laughs> We gotta we get had, them looking hot had, again. If we had world communism, all these empires would be in Nauru would right now. Yeah. Um, 
to, to <laughs> each according to their, their need. need. Yeah. Um, and with, they, they need it. They need, they need it. That bad. Big baby. Um, with time, they may start to help countries nibble away at their obesity. It's not about, oh, this is insane to be like, there's a, there's a, there's a public health issue that's like universal. It's worldwide yeah. created by capitalism. What we need is more private businesses to to also sell the the yep. the mirror image of this product yep. um, to even it out. It's like no, there's a reason just, that all this all the food is so shit, and yeah. that's what it's, everyone it's wants to profit. sell. Yeah, it's because you you want people to be addicted to shit, and you want to make it with the cheapest, worst ingredients you can. And it's yep. like obviously this is going to happen. But weight loss as well is just so individualized. The way everyone talks about it, it's, it's yeah. just like it's just like behaviors yeah, that you should be, be doing. Better. You've got to. It, more uh, education so that more people can do these things themselves and, and stop being stupid, stop being yeah, lazy, yeah, yeah. eat better. It's, it's so lame. So stupid and wrong. So we cannot allow calorie gap. Um, <laughs> we sold obesity making food too expensive. That's so silly. Um, I tell of a turkey tail, the part of the bird best life. What is low cost? Cause? I don't get it. It's a joke. It's a pun. They're trying to catch us out. That means it's a miracle drug for real. Apparently, it's good for diabetes. Well, yeah, I think that was the initial that was you, yeah. use for it. Um, well, yeah, I, I, I agree, poor plumber. I think walkable cities are a massive part of it as well. Yeah. But it's like, well, I don't want to do walkable cities because that requires public ownership of things and public planning of cities and these you need to invest in trains and public transport it's much easier to just privatize all transport yeah so much better it's not my it's not the city the social responsibility to make sure that people can get places you have to buy a car and you have to do all the things and if you don't you're a fucking loser pay for it pay for it buy petrol pay 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 oh god what what freaked me out though because i thought livable cities like walkable cities was whatever i'm that's yeah. what I was confused. I oh, was like, no, it's, thought, co- it's communism. Yeah. That's woke communism. They're, they're being tracking forced. You. They're tracking you and, and keeping you in a gated. You like, actually, what we all want is cars and highways. That's what we want. But these bloody communists are trying to give us trees. Yeah. But also what's so annoying is that these conservatives who are against the like 10 minute cities, you always fucking laugh and fantasize about like a village community yep. and the old way of life. And it's like, as soon as, there's any policy that could potentially bring that to you. Yeah, no. You realize, no, what you actually have is a fucking buffoon who does communist. whatever big business tells them to do. Yeah. It's like, you don't actually care about villages. You don't actually care is, about community. This is what I always say. It's like the most annoying thing of trying to read what right-wingers talk about is there is no consistency. No, no. They don't have any... The only ones who have ideology are the fascists. Mm. They actually have a consistent ideology mm. that they apply to thing. The rest of these conservatives, mm. they're just saying no. Yeah. You're just saying no, uh, but actually no, uh, actually no. You're not being sensible. You're not being yeah. uh, realistic That's here. No, no, no. The they do. They've got an alternative <laughs> idea of the future. It's yeah. evil and horrible, but at least it's an idea. Yeah. Yeah. All these other ones are just like, I, uh, um, I don't like this because it's against traditional values. And then when you try to bring things into like more community-based stuff, they're like, oh, I don't like this because... Like, We've got to be oh, modern and efficient. Modern and efficient. Yeah. And like, you know, there's all these things going on. Yep. Yeah. yeah. It's so it? gross. I hate it. I thought this was the one thing that everyone could agree on. Yeah. Just like... Well, we agree. Sure. Yeah, We're true. on the same page about this. Yeah, the, the, the fascist and the... The fascist and the... It's with the horseshoe theory. You're what am the, I? You're the Vucic, Third worldist. Vucic communist. <laughs> he's, he's a communist. <laughs> um, work walk will see he's a gay and trans. Exactly. Hey, everyone. Here's an edited clip from a boy-boy live stream. If you want to catch these live, they stream three times a week on Twitch. Enjoy this highlight. 